let us now study about electrical cells and batteries a cell is a device which converts chemical energy into electrical energy okay so what does a cell do a cell this is an electric cell okay let here electric cell itself electric cell converts chemical energy into electrical energy to electrical and write down surface electrical energy okay so let's see what are the parts of a cell okay so we can take a glass beaker okay and uh, we must have two metal surfaces here okay this is one metal and this second metal let me draw it like this okay first and second metal okay these two metals are called as electrodes e l e c t r o d e s electrodes okay and then there is a liquid kept inside okay there is liquid here this liquid is called as electrolyte electrolyte okay so let's take a simple voltaic cell okay very simple cell it's called as a voltaic cell what are the parts of this okay so you must have two electrodes here this electrode you can make it as copper let's short form here copper okay copper will be positive and then this one is zinc okay zinc will be the negative okay this positive and negative here okay so let's see let me take short the electrolyte the liquid you must use is dilute h2so4 that means dilute sulfuric acid okay there will be chemical reaction happening and due to that there will be electricity produced here okay so let's see how to draw a cell okay what is the symbol of cell one long line and a short line okay long line is positive short line is negative this means cell a group of cells is called as a battery okay so long line short line then paint it this way and the long line short line and the one long line short line so this will have in common plus and common minus this is called as a battery okay battery means group of cells so what does it do see the chemical reaction will create a potential difference between the two electrodes here okay and that will push the electrons so i have now two cells kinds of cells here now this is the first one ordinary cell okay you see that this is an ordinary cell here we can't recharge this okay it will if you see it's printed here 1.5 volts here somewhere this is top one is positive bottom one is negative okay and then uh, It's printed here 1.5 volt battery 1.5 volt is printed here okay this is cell okay this we can't recharge once you use it we have to throw it away okay that's another kind of cells which we can recharge okay this is a kind of cell which we can recharge it's a rechargeable cell it's nickel cadmium cell okay it will give a voltage of 1.2 volt okay this down one is a negative and top is a positive we can recharge it many times and we can use it for devices okay then even commonly also we can make a cell using a lemon also okay you can take a lemon you can keep any two metals different metals but okay keep two different metals here this is a lemon here okay keep the different metals here different metals these are the electrodes okay. in textbook they given as copper and zinc we can use different metals whatever you have okay they should be different that's the only thing so you can make a simple cell using it okay an led can work for long time using this lemon cell you can also make a using other vegetables like potato also you can make a cell okay so this is about the electric cells the first person to make the cell was alessandro volta okay to honor him only we give the assumed as volt that you must also remember okay we'll be studying more about the electric cells in the coming classes okay so so note this down and thank you for watching